Hey, we heard some big news recently. Big company. We heard that Apple big and tech. their AirPods are going to have a hearing aid mode coming out soon. Mm -hmm. So some of you have heard about OTC, over-the-counter hearing devices, but who would have thunk? Who would have ever thought that something I already own could become one of these who would have thought the biggest tech company in the world yeah apple <laughs> would I mean, innovate <laughs> and get in on this it's OTC pretty it's really game. exciting and the reason why as doctors we're excited is anytime people are talking about their hearing and trying to do better and trying to be healthier we want to be part of the discussion yeah. and so what we know and and again we don't know the layout we just know it's probably going to happen around the end of 2024 maybe the beginning of 2025 but this ios update will hit these apple phones and if you happen to own airpods those airpods will now become more um, advanced and they'll be able to do some things with a hear through function that can optimize hearing in different areas to be a little bit more specific a little more detailed than say a normal hear through function with just a traditional earbud so we're going to be looking for an update it's going to be coming towards the end of this year and it's it's actually really exciting yeah it'll allow a new mode a hearing aid mode which is new and, mm -hmm. and it'll function more like some of these over-the-counter devices yeah. and maybe some predictions about it we've found with over-the-counter devices in general that they're a really great way for people to get introduced to great, hearing aids. great segue it's kind of great it's segue. kind of a gateway a little bit mm -hmm. into the more prescription the, the fancier devices mm -hmm. but it has been good people have 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 dared a little bit to, to you know dip yeah. their toe in the water of hearing aids and try this over-the-counter mm -hmm. device and get a little taste of what it's like to hear better but maybe another prediction is they won't love yeah that's wearing it 24 7 we love that people will be able to enhance their hearing the most important thing though is that you're enhancing your hearing in a, in a very appropriate way in a detailed way in a way that says I'm hitting targets exactly so that I'm as close to normal hearing as possible. That has been kind of difficult to achieve with the over-the-counter devices for most of the people that come through our clinic. But I'm envisioning someone at home that's trying this out. They're not quite ready maybe to come to the clinic yet. They don't really know how much hearing loss they have. So they get their phone out, they take a little hearing test in a quiet room, they do their best, and they start playing with this idea of I need to hear better I love this idea. We love the idea of people hearing better. We love the awareness it's going to create. You know, there'll obviously be a little talk about this, mm -hmm. a little buzz about this. But kind of going back to what I was mentioning a second ago, I also predict that once people have tried an over-the-counter device or once they've used their AirPod as an over-the-counter device, they're going to realize these are kind of big things. They are big. I don't know that I want this in my ear all the time. Go to, go to church with it, you know, AirPods in, yeah. in one ear, both ears, kind of makes you feel kind of like, you know, you're living a distracted life. Well, you know, because, yeah. Because, you know, when you see someone with AirPods, mm -hmm. you're like, hey, you you hearing yeah. me? Yeah, are you, you listening, listening to me? me? What are you, yeah, what's yeah. going on here? And I think it might send the wrong message, and, and eventually some people might think, you know, I kind of want a more discreet prescription hearing aid right, that fits right. a little better, mm -hmm. more custom programmed to my needs and my hearing loss. Yep. So I do think overall this is going to be a really cool thing. Lots of good awareness. Great to help people hear better yep. and probably a good gateway for people to transition into to more prescription custom hearing aids. We hope that not only, you know, the, the AirPod and the Apple stuff, we're, we're grateful that they're doing this. We hope the other cell phone companies do this also with their, you know, whether it's Samsung or, or you know, LG, Google. Google. Yeah, whoever. I mean, I would think this is going to have a ripple effect mm -hmm. and that people will be able to, say, two, three years from now, have their earbuds in and be able to enhance things differently I think it's gonna be really good and so you know, we're excited yeah about maybe it. even people that are a little younger D that maybe don't want to quite admit yet that maybe they're having some trouble hearing mm -hmm. this might be a really good thing for them to get a little taste of, 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 of better hearing enhance their hearing situationally like yeah. hey, well, it's family night let's watch a movie together as a family Mom, let's put in my yeah, or dad put in my or, AirPods. Yeah, Johnny go grab your AirPods or go grab your earbuds so I think it could be really positive. So we're excited about this. Uh, we hope you are too, and we'll all just wait and see how it, how it uh, affects all of you, and we're excited to see how it affects the hearing community at large. So, so stay tuned, right? Stay End of the year, 2025, stay, stay tuned. tuned.